Beautiful. So I'm Joel Sartori with National Geographic Photo Arc. Can't go anywhere because of the pandemic, so we're doing insects this summer, starting as soon as it warmed up in May, all the way till frost, really. Lots and lots of insects, hundreds of species, because invertebrates help make the world go around, and we haven't gotten too many of them in the photo arc till this summer. So we're trying to do what we can during the pandemic to find a silver lining. My daughter Ellen's been helping me all summer, which is really nice. Tonight we're at Indian Cave State Park in Nebraska, and it is a fabulous place, like many of Nebraska state parks, for insect diversity. No chemical use here, no agriculture here. It's just big rolling river bluffs along the Missouri River. And we've set up our sheets with our big lights. We're gonna fire up the generators and we'll see what we get. So our process here is we string out white sheets on the ground and on light stands. And then when it gets dark enough, any minute now, we'll fire up portable generators and we'll run these 250 watt bulbs and we'll run them for a couple, three hours and we'll see what comes in. And if something new comes in, great. We'll catch that, put it in a cup, photograph it and let it go. And to date, we've probably got about 500 species just since May and it's late August now. So we're, we're rolling along. We'll get as much as we can here in Nebraska until frost comes sometime in October. I've been looking for years for somebody to identify the insects that we were getting all along. You know, there's nobody better than Lauren and Babs Paddleford that I've ever met. I was so desperate to find somebody who was just curious about the natural world, curious enough to really want to dig in and learn what these insects were. They were the people I've been looking for for years. You know, there's, there's millions of insect species and there's probably millions that have never been discovered or identified or written about. And there's probably maybe millions that are disappearing without ever knowing that they ever existed. You cannot have a photo arc showing biodiversity without it being full of insects. And that's exactly what we're doing this summer. I made a comment to Joel that you will never run out of something to photograph with insects. And I think he's starting to realize that. I keep him busy. like. 40 hours a week sometimes. I don't know how they do it. We're approaching 500 for the uh, for this time we've been working with Joel. And uh, maybe before the season, there we'll have over a thousand, so you can add that to his photo arc. That'll be a, a nice addition. When you think about insects, a lot of people just think about mosquitoes or flies, but the insect world is millions of species that keep life on Earth going for all of us. Insect surveys have shown that there's been a huge decrease in number of insects and, and the insect diversity. So it's very important to maintain insect populations. If we don't, I think we're in deep, deep trouble. You know, you don't have to save the whole world, but you should try to save what's in your own backyard. That's easy to do and fun, especially now that we can't really go anywhere. <laughs>